Let me. I think there's a few more in there. <laughs> Just uh, throwing them out in there. All right, guys. So here is all my Dino Chargers, all nice and sorted. We're gonna look at all of them individually. So first, we have the Spino Charger, or Spinosaurus. Um, that's what the back looks like. It's the QR code. And the two of these I have are exactly the same. I managed to get a double. So this is what the charging it up does. Pretty neat. Next we have the clear Tyrannosaurus charger, which is number one. The last one was zero. I forgot to mention that. Here's the QR code. And then let's do the animation. I wouldn't call it animation, but like down a charger ready kind of thing. Next we have the one that most people will probably have if they bought the Dino Charge Morpher, which this one says Tyrannosaurus Rex. Very tiny. There we go. QR code. And let's go through. This one is a little like sticky. It doesn't like it does halfway. I don't know if you can see that. It's maybe it's just mine, but it's a little odd. But that's our animation. Next we have the Japanese version of Kyojir, I think you say it. I'm sorry if I completely butchered that. This one's uh, Gabutyra, um, which this one is more show accurate. It literally just click and changes like Dino Charger ready, boom, awesome. This one does not have a QR code, it just got pegs so you can put it in their version of the Morpher. Next we have the Dino Supercharger, which this one says Tyrannosaurus Rex in white and red, and I think it looks really cool. Here's your QR code, and this is the animation, which it's like a big T-Rex to a little baby one, which I think is really cute. Here we have the fossil version of the supercharger, and this one, let's do it through the animations, it, the QR code should be the same, and this is the same. Next we're going through black, which... The Black Ranger is the Parasaurolophus, which I'm surprised I actually managed to get that to fit. Here's your QR code. Let's go through the animations. This one also kind of sticks, like the T-Rex one. This, or I don't think it was this one. The other one I think I have, which I'll show off because it's pretty interesting. They're the exact same charger, but this one is like much smaller. For some reason, this one is a little sticky when you click it. And let's see, the QR code should be exactly the same. I think that one's upside down. And then, yeah, they both say Parasaurus. Next we got Boycota here, the Blue Ranger with the Stegosaurus, which is very terrible font. You can barely read it. But there's your QR code. And let's do the animations. And that's that for Coda. also have the fossil version of Coda's Dino Charger. QR code should be the same, still same terrible font. Like you can kind of see it there. It's just why why not do white or something is what I was thinking. I guess it's not so accurate. I don't know. Uh, here's the uh, animation. Let me hold it that way. So basically, it's just fossil glowy, normal glowy. So yeah. Next we're on to number four, the Green Ranger Riley's Dino Chargers, which. This one is my favorite, and I have the most of them, so just be prepared for a lot of these. So, this is kind of sticky, too. Yeah, I hate it when they're sticky. I like it when they click nice, like the Spinosaurus one, very nice clicking. I actually use it as a clicker to train my dog, which is interesting. But yeah, here we got Riley, so it's just same as the other ones. Here's your QR code. This is Velociraptor, which this is like kind of a brighter green, so it shows up. I do wish it was written a little better. It's pegs. Here's the fossil version of Riley's charger. Like we say, normal glowy, fossil glowy. Same QR code. Same thing on the back. Here we have the Japanese or Super Sentai version of the Green Ranger Morpher. And this one is Zakutur. Just has pegs on both sides. And this one is much more show accurate, even the size too. I didn't give a good size comparison. But that's the size difference, kind of insane. Now, you know, Dino Charger ready. Sorry, that was the wrong way. But yeah, that's pretty neat. When we open up, when we open up my pack, I got three more of these Dino Chargers. So let's start going through them. So this one is very similar to the first one I showed you guys. 
except the number on it is black for some reason, and the teeth are not white, which is really interesting. The back, I believe, is the same. The QR code and stuff should be exactly the same. Just really interesting. I don't know. Uh, this one I think I got in a large pack of them, so I'm not sure why they're different. But this one, this one clicks much better, but it's the exact same. Next we got the animation chargers, which are actually my favorite chargers. Even though they're not so accurate or anything, they're just so much fun to play with. Let me get a good angle on it. So if we do it fast enough, you can. it looks like the Velociraptor is like swishing its tail at you, which in the Zord it's like three blades that just go whoop. But yeah, that's really cool. I love these ones. And actually these ones are quite different. See, we have a silver, which is actually like a kind of shiny silver compared to this dull silver, or gray I guess. The symbols are the same, it's just the outside is green. Here, you can see here, this is the shiny silver, and actually it was written a lot better. I love this text much better on these ones than the original ones, which I don't like as much. Here is our final Velociraptor charger. Sorry, I have so many of them. But this one's actually the shiny foil kind, which I like. Yeah, that's what it is. This one, I think, is going backwards. Or no, it's probably normal. Uh, most everything else same. This one actually I think has the larger font, which is really interesting how they do different fonts on these. I don't know if a lot of people notice that. Wish they kept the bigger fonts on all of them. Next we got Shelby the Pink Ranger, who at first I really didn't like, but uh, she really grew on me as a character. We got this shiny foily version of her pink morpher. Got the Triceratops, which this one's actually in big font. Eggs. And then that's our QR code. Here's the second version, which this one is the non foily version. As you can see, it just fills up. We got a tiny, tiny triceratops there. Same QR code, pegs. Here we got the animated version of Shelby's Charger. And this one's actually one of my favorites. I was playing with this one during class one time, just like clicking it and watching it go through. Sorry if it's hard to see it. And then my teacher was like, what is that clicking noise? But uh, yeah, as you can see, it's very hard to tell, but the tail turns into a drill and drills through. So it's just really cool. I love these animated ones. I wish I had more of them, but then we got a big Triceratops and like I said, this silver paint on these, which is really awesome. Next we got Ivan. Which, I don't have a normal, per se, charger of Ivan's. I got this clear one, which, like, does a normal animation, I would assume, on the regular one. That's six in white, and then the silver, tear it on, QR code. Um, yeah, I never got his Morpher. I heard it was really cheap and poorly made, so I never ended up getting it. But, yeah, that's the only Morpher I'm missing, but this is his charger. This is my other version of Ivan's charger, which this was, like the second charger I got or something like that which just does the fossil animations as you can see like the glowy, the non-glowy this one's backwards I think which is interesting and then we got the QR code, same the big lettering of pterodon okay. next we got the ankylosaurus or ankylosaurus as I say in the show or the aqua rangers charger this is the shiny foily version of this charger let's go through the animation seven ankylosaurus and this one's in the bigger lettering next we got the fossil version of this charger which i think is really neat i just love looking at how the dinosaurs look they look really cool i don't remember here's the qr code big lettering yeah and that's the ankylosaurus fossil charger next we have the pachysaur pachycephalosaurus which i really love the graphite rangers dino charger here's his animation I love this drawing too, and it's number 8. Here's your QR code. Then this is obviously a very long word, so they're not going to have bigger text like this one. I completely understand the smaller text for it. Next we have the uh, shiny, foily version of this charger, which is very similar, just shiny. This one's also kind of, I think I can maybe get it? Yeah, kind of stay in the middle. This one's like not good at clicking through. You gotta really push it in there. I think you can hear it too, but back and stuff is the same on this charger. So yeah. Here is the uh, fossil version of the Pachycephalosaurus. And let's flick through it. Shiny. Fossil, shiny, normal. Same QR code. Obviously same lettering. Yeah. Next we got the Plesiosaurus. 
like a giant sea monster. This one I really like a lot. I think it looks really cool. Got the head there, number 9. Here's your QR code. This one, I don't like the lettering because purple and black is hard to see. You can still read it there, please your source. And this is uh, the clear version. This is a clear version, and the clear versions actually come with the Megazords, which I have all of those if you're interested in another video on those. But yeah, that's the Plesiosaurus. Next here we have the shiny, foily version of the Plesiosaurus, or purple Dino Charger. There's your animation for that, which is pretty cool. Sorry it's so hard to see it. I'm trying to get the light to show how shimmy it is. Neat. And then same QR code. Dark lettering. And last but not least, we have the Titano Charger, the Titan or the Brachiosaurus, which I think it's interesting. It's called the Titano Charger, but whatever. There is your QR code, and then here, this one I think is really cool. How it's animated, like the silver and stuff. It looks awesome. It's number ten, and this is the only one that I don't have two versions of it, just because it's so difficult to get. I got this one with the Morpher or um, the Xenowings Morpher. Next we're going into non-ranger chargers, which this one is the super drive charger. I'll do it that way, because I think it's so how it's supposed to be done. It's pretty neat. It's not exactly the same as the show. The show I think went from like that to the other one, but it's still really neat. The last says super drive, it's pegs, and there's your QR code. Next we have the victory charger, which I think this one's really cool. This one's the fossil version, which it's actually like got a shiny coat to it. I don't know how to describe it. It's victory there. There's your QR code for that. Nah, let's go through it. We can see the Triceratops Velociraptor. It's very hard to see the Stegosaurus and then the Parasaurolophus and the T-Rex. Go through that. Let's try not to get the glare. Which I think the fossils look just awesome. You can really distinguish them with the fossils. It's hard to tell with them colored, but you know, gotta do that. It's the victory charger. Here we have the uh, maximum charger. It just has all the other dinosaurs that were not included in the victory charger. If you combine them, you get the victory maximum charger. So this is the shiny foil one. And this one has the same like sparkly effect as the victory charger. Um, so yeah, this has his maximum with a big X. Let's click through these. Pretty neat. So we got the pterodactyl, the ankylosaurus, the pachycephalosaurus, the plesiosaurus, and the brachiosaurus, or the titanosaurus, I guess it's called. Here that is the interesting symbol that I didn't really go over, but it has the uh, logo, which is interesting. Here we have uh, the 11th dino charger, which is the dino nitrous? Dino... I don't know how to say that. The number 11, which is the dino cycle charger. Uh, which gives them their motorcycles, which is kind of interesting. There's your animation. It kind of looks like the Velociraptor or something there. I think he's feathered, but this is the foil version of that. There's a QR code for the cycle charger. Next we have the Dino Armor X charger, which is number 12, which is the Dino Suchus, which is a giant prehistoric alligator. So, yeah, and he's orange. Really neat. Here's the QR code for the Dino Armor X charger. Next we have the Dino Cupid charger, which is, is the fossil version of it. Here's the QR code. And the Stacker... Styracosaurus, I believe. And this is a fossil version. This one's not clicks very good, or maybe it does. Not. And then there's your picture. Still really neat. Next we have number 15. Ooh. Which I believe is the Dino Blaze Charger Mix Fire. There's your there's your QR code. It's the Allosaurus. And this one's like a translucent red. It kinda looks like a T Rex, just got a little thing on it. But this is a new version. These are the egg chargers, so it starts with the egg. It's like, whoa, it's gonna hatch, and then it hatches in the Zord. Kinda like Dino Thunder it makes me think of. But yeah, this is uh I don't have any of the regular Zords from the Rangers in this version, just this one, which is pretty interesting. Next we have the uh, Dino Stretch Charger, which is number 16, and it is the Diplodocus, very tinily written in black, and this one's the fossil version of the Charger. This one's not very sticky, but yeah, that's that one, pretty neat. Here's the uh, QR code. Next we have the Arcalon, which I have three of these for some reason, I really don't know why, but a lot of the ones, Chargers I wanted to get had this dude in it. 
So there's your QR code. It's the Archelon. They never actually used it in the show that I think of. And this is the one I did in my other video to show how to make it more show accurate. So we go from full or empty to full. And then I put the other ones in there. So if you guys want, I'll put a link in the description to my other video on how to make this happen. This was just a test. So we got these, and you can't afford the other ones. The Japanese ones. There you go. There's the fossil version of the Archelon charger, which apparently it's called the Dino Gravity Charger. And I think they used it, like, in the Titano Zord Ultimate, whatever it's called. They used it, like, Gr briefly, briefly, without even like doing it. Same QR code. Look at a turtle. It's really cute. Here we have the egg version of the Archelon charger. We got the yellow with the blue or purple. I think that's more of a dark blue. It's Archelon. We got the yellow, which the yellow button really stands out. It's number 21. Go through that. It's like, whoa, you have to have the egg. And I have all these figures, or a lot of them, not all of them. If you guys would like another video about that. And we're going into our final chargers. Um, I have the, I guess we'll call them legacy chargers. It's the Dino Thunder one. Dino Thunder is my favorite season of Power Rangers. So this one's got the Red Ranger, the White Ranger, who is my favorite Ranger. And we got the Megazord. So it's Power Rangers Dino Thunder logo. There's your QR code. It says Dino Thunder. Next we got the RPM charger, which I also love RPM. Not as much as Dino Thunder, but obviously a great season of Power Rangers. The Red Ranger, the Gold Ranger, their Megazord, a high octane Megazord, um, then the logo, which is pretty awesome. It's a QR code. Next, we got a. This one is a Legacy Charger, but it is of the Japanese version of the Legacy Charger, which is Geki Ranger, or Jungle Fury as we call it, which has their logo. And this one obviously doesn't have a QR code. This one just goes from full to not full. Still really cool. I like it. It just came with the pack that I got, which is really neat. Uh, Jungle Fear is also one of my favorite seasons. Some really good stuff. And yeah, that's all my Dino Charger collection. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want to do anything else with these guys. I'd be happy to put them all in the charger, which I did another video similar to that. Not all of them, because a lot of them say the same stuff. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And Dino Charger, power up. Mm. If you guys don't like, comment, and subscribe, that you'll hear this in your nightmare.